Next question. Question number 44. Which one of the following would produce maximum elevation of body? A. 0.1 m glucose, 0.1 m fructose, 0.1 m barium chloride, 0.1 m magnesium sulfate. Kindly follow. This is uh, coming under the elevation of boiling point. That is, coming under the colligative property. What is the colligative property? Any property which depends on only on the number of particles is colligative property, but which is not on the nature of the particle. There are four types of colligative properties we are studying in higher secondary level. One is the relative lowering of upper pressure, elevation of boiling point, depression of pressing point, and osmotic pressure. Here, question asked under the elevation of boiling point. What is the elevation of boiling point? How we have to correlate with this? Let me explain now. First one, according to Raoult's law, the elevation of boiling point is directly proportional to molality of the solution. This is the important point. What is elevation of boiling point? That means, when we follow, we have a solvent in R. And we have solution E, this is nothing but delta dB. So, whenever you take a solvent and add it, this not with any solute, the boiling point of solution will be elevated. That is called elevation of boiling point. That is delta dB. According to Bayes law, it is proportional to molality of the solution. What is the definition of molality here? I know, we know. The elevation of boiling point is directly proportional to molality of solution we have already written there. I can simply equal the equation by putting a constant that is equal to Kb into M. Where Kb is the, that is the molar elevation boiling point constant, which is nothing but proportionality constant. Nothing but proportionality constant for water it is 0.52. Okay. Therefore, delta Tb equal to Kb into M. But I know that from the definition of molality, what is molality? Number of moles of solute dissolved in 1 kilogram of solvent. So, N2 by W1 I can introduce. Therefore, substitute in this case. So, the most important point here it is, this is the equation. That means, kindly follow the N2. So, here is coming now, delta Tb, elevation of boiling point, which is the colligative property because it depends upon the number of particles. Thus, the elevation of boiling point is the colligative property. Okay, let me rearrange. Delta Tb equal to Kb into M2 by M2 into W1 since N2 equal to mass by molecular weight. This is the equation. Now, how we have to correlate with the particle? So, kindly follow. This is M2 by capital M2, that is most important. So, number of particles, now we have to correlate. Can you see from this equation, higher the number of particles, higher will be elevation of boiling point. Lower the number of particles, lower will be elevation of boiling point. So, from this, here, here the correct answer is C, 0.1 M barium chloride, so it contain 3 particles, Hence, higher the particle will be higher the elevation of boiling point. We will go for this, coming for the answer now. 0.1 m glucose, only one particle because organic. 0.1 m fructose, one particle organic. This is 0.1 m barium chloride, one barium, two chloride, three particles. 0.1 m methane sulfate, one and plus one, two particles. So this is having higher number of particles. So that is the higher. That means which one of the following would produce maximum elevation of boiling point? 0.1 m barium chloride will would produce maximum elevation of boiling point. That is the correct answer. 